So I used to think that Vox was the most one-sided and biased news source out there. But now that PragerU has gotten a massive following, and now that I've done more research into PragerU, I have to give the crown to PragerU. If PragerU was founded just to present topics from the point of view of conservatism and religion, I would not be making this video. But that is not the reason PragerU was founded. PragerU was founded literally to destroy the left. And I am not exaggerating. You can hear the founder of PragerU, Dennis Prager, saying it himself. Defeating the left is as great a moral urgency as defeating Islamism. Hmm. Those are the two uh, uh, enemies of Western civilization as we know it. So all of the left is equal to Islam, which is equal to the worst enemy of Western civilization. I'm not an expert mathematician, but something seems very dangerous about that equation. In addition to the blatant Islamophobia, Dennis Prager, the founder of Prager University and the person that screens all of PragerU's videos, just admitted that PragerU's mission is not to educate and clarify on topics where people may be ignorant of the conservative perspective. PragerU's mission is literally to eradicate leftist ideology from society since it is apparently the worst enemy to Western civilization. And if you look at PragerU's videos, you can clearly see that this is their mission. All of PragerU's videos revolve around how conservatism is great and why you should be a conservative, or why leftism is morally corrupt and evil and why you should walk away from being a leftist, or how America is perfect and has no inherent problems except for the problems that are caused by the left. And this evasiveness to address inherent problems with America is a problem that is ubiquitous among people on the right, and I have a whole video talking about this. But PragerU takes it to a whole nother level. I obviously don't have the time to go into every single PragerU video, but I wanted to show you this quick clip where PragerU tells you that racism is not a problem in this country. Is there still racism in America? Of course there is. But racism is not in America's DNA. Recent history and a lot of research and data prove it. As liberal Harvard sociologist Orlando Patterson said, America is now the least racist white majority society in the world has a better record of legal protections of minorities than any other society, white or black, offers more opportunities to a greater number of black persons than any other society, including all of those of Africa. Patterson, by the way, is black. Well, he's black. Racism solved. <laughs> First of all, that black professor that he cites in that video would later go on to talk about how America is absolutely still dealing with the consequences of its racist past. Second of all, in that video, they only bring up statistics that support the view that America is not racist, while completely ignoring all the other statistics and research that prove otherwise. For example, they don't talk about how uh, black Americans are severely underrepresented in high-paying jobs and leadership positions. They don't talk about how socioeconomic mobility is much harder for black Americans. And they don't talk about how the prison system and the sentencing of black Americans is much harsher than for white Americans, just to name a few. And that goes for all of PragerU's videos. In all of their videos, they'll only have people on that are conservative. They'll only show you statistics and research that align with the conservative agenda and completely ignore statistics and research that challenge that view. And in most of their videos, they're going to try and tell you how the left is lying to you and completely wrong and how conservatives are the only ones that are trying to tell you the actual truth. And I'm not calling for PragerU to be canceled or shut down. I just think that you should realize that when you watch a PragerU video, you are getting your information from the most biased source possible. And after you watch a PragerU video, I really think that you should do yourself a favor and do some independent research into the topic that the video discussed. I guarantee you you'll find some additional information that the video conveniently left out. What do you guys think? Do you think that PragerU provides good information and is a valuable perspective on the internet? Or do you agree with me that PragerU videos should be approached with a lot of skepticism? Or maybe you're on the other side of the spectrum and you think that YouTube and other sources should not even be supporting PragerU videos. Let me know what you think, I'm really interested. And yeah, that's about it. Thank you so much for watching.